Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Yvonne, if I have not met you before. But anyway, I am going to do a vlog of this weekend. It's Labor Day weekend, so it's going to be a very, very eventful weekend. Let me tell you, so you don't want to miss this one. Right now, it's 9 o'clock. I'm going to go teach a cycle bar class, and I am so tired. I don't know. I just think I didn't get enough sleep, like, throughout this entire week, and it's just now hitting me, like, yesterday night and then today. It's just been totally hitting me, so I'm a little bit tired, but you know, nothing a little Celsius can't fix. So, so my class today is all K names. So we're doing Kaigo, Khalifa, Katy Perry. So those three names are featured in today's class, and it is a boppin' playlist. Katy Perry literally slays. I don't know what happened to her. I wish she still came out with music because all of her songs are just so poppy like they're all super catchy so i don't know but now it's nine o'clock so let's go into the studio and get this day started the class is done it went very very well i had so much fun and i just love katie perry why did she fall off i mean she has such good songs like i played firework and it popped off like that's such a good song but anyway this day is going to be a long but beautiful and great day Right now I'm going shopping with my fiance's mom. We're gonna go shopping because I have an engagement party tomorrow. My side of the family is throwing it so she wants to buy me a dress <laughs> to wear for it. So we're gonna go shopping. I'm really excited about that. So I'm gonna take a shower here because I'm super sweaty and then get dressed, maybe grab coffee or breakfast or something like that because I kinda need it. But yeah, I gotta go because I'm trying to be there at like 11. It's like 10.30, so let's go and have a great, fun day. So I have a free Starbucks drink, so oh my god, I need to like, my dry shampoo looks so bad right now. But um, I'm gonna go get my Starbucks drink because I had a free one, so I added an extra shot, got a large, got all the stuff inside, so I'll tell you what I ordered and how it tastes once I'm there. Right, so I just got my Starbucks and I got my breakfast sandwich. I got the turkey bacon sandwich and then my drink looks kind of sus um i got a shaken espresso and it looks super light in color so i don't know but what i ordered was the venti iced brown sugar shaken espresso so i added pumpkin cream cold foam an extra shot of espresso and then i played with the pumps of the syrup so i got two pumps of brown sugar two pumps of sugar-free vanilla, two pumps of pumpkin. So let's see how it's gonna taste. I feel like I'm not even gonna get a good taste because with these you have to shake them because everything is like stuck at the bottom, like all the espresso shots. So let me give it a little shake. It's really good. That's so good, but I need to mix it. I'm very satisfied, it's very delicious. So now let's go shopping. A lot later on Friday, me and Joey's mom had a great day of shopping. I'm now with Joey. It's a little bit later, around 8 o'clock, and we're going to go to this place in OTR over the Rhine. It's called Copper and Flame, and this place is closing down. It's one of our favorite places, honestly, in over the Rhine. So we're really sad that it's closing. It's basically this self pour bar, and they also have food there. So we're going to go get one more drink there. We're gonna have an early night tonight because we're both super duper tired because neither of us slept well last night and had super busy and long days but we kind of debated if we should go tonight to here we were like you know what it's gonna be our last time we're gonna be able to go so we're like of course we should go so we're gonna have a few drinks we'll see where the night takes us I don't know how long we're gonna stay I'm literally not even wearing any makeup so if that tells you anything but at least I did dress up and I wore and I'm wearing one of the outfits that I got today, so I'll show you the outfit once I get out of the car and everything. Do you have anything to say, Joey? Yeah, we're tired. And we have a beautiful sunset right ahead, so I will show you that.
Hey guys, it's me Yvonne. It is Saturday. I am on my way to teach my Psycho Bar class. It is around 10 a.m. So I will talk to you guys once I'm there because I'm literally at a stoplight and I need to inform you before the day goes on. Okay, gotta go. <laughs> my class went so well. It was so much fun. And now I have an engagement party. My and Joey's engagement party is tonight. So I'm really excited for that. I'm going to get ready. But before I get ready, I'm actually gonna upload one of my YouTube videos because I really wanted to upload it like yesterday, but I had no time to literally because I was nonstop all day. So I didn't have time to make the final editing touches and then upload it. So I'm gonna upload that today. So make sure you check out that video if you haven't already. But yeah, let's go have a Saturday. I'm just so happy it's a long weekend because I just feel like I can relax so much and just like do things that I want to, things that I enjoy, you know? Hi guys, it's a little bit later now. We are on the way to the engagement party. Joey is getting some gas right now, so I thought this would be a perfect time to tell you all the story of how we got engaged. I feel like I didn't really explain it that well the last time when I uploaded the I got engaged video, so let me give you the background knowledge. Okay, so we were going to OU for this weekend because it was brew fest, so I had this plan for a couple months we got our hotel and everything like that and then a few months before or like a month before we were gonna go to OU he was like Friday the day before we go to OU we should like start off the weekend by going to a nice dinner in Cincinnati before we go and I was like okay yeah that's fun but my intuition literally like struck me and I was like that's weird like why is he oh he turned the car back on <laughs> <laughs> the AC is on and I can't turn it down. I don't know what's going on. Um, but anyway, so whenever he said that, my intuition struck and I was like, that's really weird. Like, that he said that, like, it's a month away. Like, why would he tell me that a month in advance? And like, that is just super weird. And then after that, like, my intuition was like, <gasps> he's gonna ask me to marry him that day. So the whole time I was like, kind of like going back and forth. I was like, is he actually gonna ask me? Or am I just like, making this up in my head and then I talked to a few of my friends. I talked to my friend Liv and some of my friends from like Miami when I lived there and I was like, is that weird that he asked me that like a month a month in advance? They're like, kind of. They're like, you know what? That is kind of weird like that he mentioned that and he was like, make sure you wear like a nice, like wear a nice dress and like go out to dinner or something like that. And I was like, okay. That is very sus. Very sus, okay. And then the week comes, and I'm really looking forward to going to OU, okay? I was super happy for that week. And I was kind of looking for clues and hints from like my mom, Joey, anyone around me that could like give me a clue, you know? I was like definitely looking super closely to see if anyone would spill the beans or like nudge something one way or another. But no, I had no idea throughout the entire week. So when that day came, I convinced myself that it was not gonna happen because I thought I was like overthinking the scenario in my head, okay? And then the day comes, I got ready, got my dress on, I have my nails done, just in case, just in case. And then he picked me up, we're on our way there. I don't really know where we're going because this place we were gonna go to dinner is called the Golden Lamb. I've never even heard of it, I don't know where it is, so I was like, I didn't know where we were going anyway. <laughs> but on the way there, he was like, we're actually not going out to dinner. And then I was like, well, what are we doing? And he said, we're going on an excursion. And I'm like, oh my gosh, are we going skydiving? <laughs> I was like, are we going wine tasting? What are we doing? And then I was like, wait, I'm starving. Like, we're not going to dinner, I'm so hungry. He actually had Kirito with him. So we ate that before when we got to the location. And so I was guessing, I was guessing where we we're gonna go. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna enjoy the ride and let him surprise me for once because one thing about Joey is that he's not good at keeping secrets. He always tells me, so I was like, you know what, this time I'm just gonna let it be a surprise. Just because I'm, I'm just gonna play along with it, whatever, act like I don't know. <laughs> and then we pulled into an, an airport and I was like, We're, are we going skydiving? Like, what are we doing here? And then there was a sign that said hot air balloon. So we went on a hot air balloon ride and there was a photographer there and I figured the photographer was with the company so I didn't think anything weird about it and then they were like here like let me take your stuff we're gonna take you we're, let me take your stuff we're gonna take pictures of you guys in front of the hot air balloon and I was like okay 
So we smiled, we posed. Yeah, they were like, on. yep. And then they're like doing different pose and we did a different pose. And then Joey started reaching in his pocket and I was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh my gosh. And the whole moment I was like blinking, I was like, is this real life? Cause like it's so, I literally was so shocked when it happened. It was just crazy. But yeah, that's the story how we got engaged. We got engaged July 14th. 14th. And it is now September 2nd, so we are finally having our engagement party. So his side of the family threw something the Sunday that we got back from OU. And so my family wanted to throw something also. And it's just been, like, it took a couple months because my brother had to move out. And we had to help him like move in and stuff. So that was our main focus for like August, honestly. So now it's our celebration for our love. Oh my gosh. But yeah, it's our celebration for our love. So we're gonna have a great night. Hopefully I can vlog at the party. I'm gonna see if one of my little cousins can vlog for me. Just I feel like that'd be funny. So let's see how that goes, but let's have a fun night. I love Yvonne because she's a very sweet and genuine person and she's always thinking of others. <laughs> oh, I zoomed in. <laughs> One thing I love about Yvonne is that she's so positive and she's got such a positive mindset, super inspirational, amazing. And then one thing I absolutely love about Joey is he can just hold his own. He's so genuine, he loves Yvonne for exactly who she is and they are just the best couple. I love Yvonne because she's a great role model but most of all she's sweet and kind. Aww. That was cute. Oh, wait. Oh, honey. That's good. No, I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it. Josie, move. Oh, you're so good. <laughs> Are you actually taking a picture on a real camera? Yeah. Rossi on the rocks? Say yeah. That was a more than a shot. Okay, save some for you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you everybody for coming. So, um, just wanted to give a little shout out to Joey and Yvonne getting engaged. Um, can't believe it. Um, but I, my heart was at rest when um, Yvonne met Joey at Ghost Baby. And, um, <laughs> and they just started a really good friendship and they fell in love. And Joey did a few visits to Miami and I felt so happy that Yvonne had someone there like to go on adventures, go skip. Like why? What you guys did so many things. Did dolphins. Did a lot. Swimming with the dolphins. Um, taking the helicopter. Out. But yeah, it was really sweet just watching them grow as a couple, and they're in love. And I, it was um, Holy Saturday, the day before Easter. Joey, I was watching the Ten Commandments. <laughs> they came in from a well, late night, it? and um, and um, I thought Joey, Yvonne was upstairs, and um, Joey's like. I have a question, Peggy. It's like, I don't know if this is the right place to do it, but I'm like, you can ask me anything. And he said, I want to ask your, your permission to marry your daughter. And I started, I was trying not to cry because Yvonne would know. And um, I was like, what are you guys talking about? I just, I was like, wait, what are you guys talking about? What is going yeah, on there? But I just said, oh my gosh, you made me the happiest mom in the world Aww. because ever since I met Joey, I just, He's such a gentleman, he's such a hard worker. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's just a great person. Uh, Yvonne is the same. They both are just very diligent, hardworking, positive people, enthusiastic, um, always doing something. Always. They are. And uh, my mom, you know, I grew up here, and it, what a beautiful house. I'm just Frank and Stephanie. Are awesome for letting us have it here because it's such a beautiful place. But a funny memory that just came up because um, Yvonne is always so busy, and I'm like, Do you ever just stay home for a minute? And um, I don't know, it just came to me like in the kitchen. I was over, you know, at my mom's. I don't know what we were doing, and um, I think she was cooking fried chicken, and I had to make these little thumbprint cookies, and I had them on wax paper on the kitchen table. And um, 
Yvonne was getting into everything, and my mom goes, give her a broom, put her to work. <laughs> so she started sweeping, and then she managed to put the broom on the kitchen table and swept all the cookies onto the floor. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? But, um, but it, it was so funny. And, um, but, oh, my gosh. Joey, we love you, and we love your family, and so many great connections here with Stephanie. Like, it's meant to be. We're so happy for you. And... Um, we're here for you, you know, on the journey of planning. <laughs> and you got your two great brothers that love you so much. And all your friends from Moeller and Nana coming here. You're the best. We love you. And um, cheers to Joey and Yvonne. Cheers. 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 Yeah. We should have had so many more followers. We should have. He was out like he was he was a forerunner for like the baby for like the baby for like my brother Brady. Don't make you work out. Oh, we're in the vlog. What's up, guys? Uh, vlog world. We made it. We made it. <laughs> Started from the bottom, now we're here. Hell yeah. <laughs> I'm confused. What do you mean by that? When he said we made it, no, I'm scared. No, I'm just. <laughs> Oh! Jimmy, you'll see in the deck. Most closely test game. Don't drink this. Don't you look good tonight? Oh, you guys are good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. A joining of two great families. Yep. Yes! People I, I've known and known most for a while. Put your, so we can see. Wait, is there a recording right now? Hi, Yvonne's vlog. Do you remember me? <laughs> <laughs> is it going? Yeah, it's gone. <laughs> All right. Tom became a woman. <laughs> all the questions are like very so I don't know if you remember You better get all these colors magenta or something. You better get all this shit right. <laughs> That's a problem, lady. <laughs> no, you know. I know her, but I'm not, yeah, I'm not yeah, a good yeah. test person. It's not a big deal. It's supposed to be fun. I, I promise it's nothing right for that. It's very easy. Here is this. It's good thing about what you like. You want to hold it? You want to? Okay, everybody, right. let's You're go. probably better at this than me. Everybody, so. let's go. Where's the whistler? Okay, we have an old tool tradition for engagement parties that we do an engagement game more more than anything just to embarrass the groom <laughs> and the bride to be. So, um, everybody, listen, listen up. <laughs> okay. Break is a chart. So, the premise of the game is that they both have whiteboards and I'm going to ask them questions, but they're not answering it for themselves. They're answering it for what they think the other person's answer would be, if that makes sense. So it's pretty much like who knows each other better and then whoever has the most points at the end is the winner. Go, Joe! But there's Go, no Joe! Okay. So question number one is what is the first movie you saw together? It's an easy one. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> it could be a TV show too. Ooh, that, changes. Well, that changes it so well, much. I don't know if you can't oh, yeah. think of anything. It was, it was Barbie for yeah, sure. Was, okay, if it's a TV show. Barbie. Or, I don't, do you want to rather be a TV show? It can't be. Okay, and then on the count of three, you guys are both going to show no way. each other. Each other's answers. Okay, ready? One, two, three, oh. go. Is it cake? What is that? Do you know? Okay. It's a Netflix show where they there's all these bakers and they have to make a cake and it's like a leather briefcase. And the people guess which one is cake they, that they think. And they cut it. <laughs> Okay, this next one is No, that was a hard one. That was, that was hard. I don't, I don't even know if that's Oh, yeah, and you have an answer. Okay, Okay, all right, question number two. I was making sure they had erasers. <laughs> question number two is, what is their favorite band or artist? That's easy, Bob Seger. <laughs> that would be <laughs> <laughs> All right, one, two, three. <laughs> <laughs>
She got that right? Joey, I would have said Ariana too. I can't spell. Not <laughs> Okay. Question number three is Do you guys have a song? And if so, what is the name of that song? And if you don't have one, if you just quit, don't have one. I have one. <laughs> I know who it is. Yeah, she's looking, she's peeping. Alright, guys. Write down his name. Paul Paul Tree. Hey, hey, hey. Is there any part of one? Chew it out. So, Joey, you get a point. Right now, you get a point. Okay. And then this one, um, it says, name the best gift they ever gave you. And you guys can each write it for um, like what Joey, if she gave you a good gift, and Joe and Yvonne, if Joey gave you a good gift. Like, this one will be broken for you. Oh, yeah. Okay, yes. He's thinking a long time about this. Yeah, what can I say? Yeah, I get it. Yes. Yvonne, yes. Yes. Easy, guys. Yvonne. Um. No, no, no. From the horse, Dad. From the horse. From the horse. Yes, go. One, two, three. Joey already showed. Nice. Your nice stand gift. I love it. I do love it. I can't Okay, well, I bought my flight. We paid for my flight. Question, the question was, what was the best gift that each person gave them? And so Joey said some, a gift for her nightstand, and then Yvonne said Maui. Maui. Maui's got to take that one. <laughs> okay, so number, the fifth question is, what is your partner's biggest fear? Um... <laughs> Marriage. <laughs> David. 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 It could be I don't know. It could be bugs. Yeah. Hurricanes. They're not afraid of anything. Just say nothing. Well, that's perfect. You guys both get a point because you're both not afraid of anything. Okay. This one. Graduating. Graduating. <laughs> <laughs> I'm how I nothing. she put nothing. <laughs> oh, <Okay. to> Joey! Light <laughs> up again. Okay, this next one is more so for Joey. <laughs> how many cousins? Um, do each so you have to answer how many cousins Joey has? Easy question, Joey. <laughs> You're done. <laughs> so, yeah, how many Come on, we're talking first, second, first, first. Joey. Joey, look at me. <laughs> Joey, you better get it. Oh, good answer. Good answer. <laughs> Well, on your dad's side. There's two sides. Right? Are they right? Katie? Yeah. 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 Alright, next question is favorite restaurant. Oh, we all know that. Yeah. Um, your favorite restaurant? I don't know. I don't I don't I know. I don't know. I don't I do I don't I know. I I don't I I I was the yeah. Okay. 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 Next is, um, what would you say each other's best feature is? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, what do you like the most about each other? Oh, each other's best feature is. I know. Is that proactive? What is it? What is it? 
Yvonne wins. Yeah, I win. I couldn't read it. She's routine. She has routine. Yeah, routine down. That's good. Joey, what did you say? Routine. Routine. Very successful. Okay. 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 So you guys, so you have to answer for Joey, and then Joey, you have to answer for Yvonne. So if one of you ended up in jail at 3 a.m., who would be their first call? Ooh. Parents don't count. Parents don't count. Would be. Parents don't count. For her. Like, who would she call first? Tony. <laughs> I'm calling. I'm calling. Yeah, that's that cool me. I actually, I know, I know the UC police department. I that's I know. 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 <laughs> yeah, I don't like this. Oh, this is so I feel bad. Okay, we can change, we can reverse the question if we don't. What's their best best habit? Stop it. Give it a few years. It's just gonna roll. Let your hand. Whatever she does. We perfect. Yvonne. 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 you? What? Joey's worst habit? What's it? Um. You gotta write it down. He has you. Flip it. Write it down. I don't know how to do it. Yeah, we can move on. Okay, so the last question I'm going to ask, I'm trying to think of a good one. I'm going to, because I don't like any of these questions. <laughs> okay, I'll make it good. Okay, this this one will be like a good one. Okay, what is something that you're most excited for about your wedding? That's good. I don't think I'm Oh. Like what's the most like or what are you most excited for about marriage being married before the wedding Open bar. about being married like what are you most excited for? Are you guessing for each other? Or yeah, no, just do it for yourself. What are we most excited about for the wedding? Oh. Um And Yvonne said, be with everybody to celebrate. Oh, wow. Very different. I'm going to play the draw. I won. No, I think that I won. I didn't do that. Okay. Post game interview, how do we feel? Okay, okay, so that was a really fun game, but I also feel like we had like a few drinks in us, so it was like really hard to remember the first movie that we saw together a year and a half ago. That's why I just, so I just think I just think the questions were a little bit difficult because we had already had alcohol. Valid. But um but I think it was really fun. I think it was really fun and that we did we did a good job, but I did at the end of the day win the game. Yes. Post game interview, how are we feeling? Post game interview, I'm gonna be honest, the world, I'm a little bit drunker than I thought I'd be. Valid. Valid, valid. It's your engagement party. Yeah, her cousin Jimmy called me out on cornhole, told me I was hammered. Wasn't ready for the game, y'all, but. And who do you think won? I don't know. I wasn't seeing the answers. Yvonne might have won. I might have won. Doesn't matter the other day. We're just happy to be engaged. Okay, good answer, good answer. Reagan made the cake for me. <laughs> yes! Woo! Oh my gosh! How did you make that? With Grandma Betty's pans and piping things. <laughs> That's so beautiful. I remember, I think I've been up here. That's a really cool.
But I know I spoke. Those are, yeah, the flower. Adam! Hey! hey. How are you guys? Good to see you. Yeah, it's been a long time. <laughs> you loving college life? Oh, yeah, it's great. You loving having Brady up here? <laughs> good, good. You're, you're here for the last finale. Yeah, I know. Brandon, you have a returning guest at the front of the store. Brandon, a returning guest. We're getting the couch. Boom. At my house. <laughs> at our house. <laughs> and so we picked the fabric. So we think we're going to do... Where was it? Something in light. I think it's... It was... Uh, not that one. This one? No, it wasn't. I think it was this one. Right? Uh, Which one was it? I think it was this one. Okay, I think it was this one. It's like a light tan color. And then he said we should do like a thicker one because of like the um, the cushion inside. It's so plush. So to have like a more firmer base to do like a thicker one. So we do, we think we're going to do this one. It's coconut parchment, which is like a nice um, beige color. See, like this one is like too firm, I feel like. Yeah, it's not uh, comfy. I cannot sleep on that. Yeah, it's not soft. I like this one, everybody. Yeah. But it's way too soft. It's going to get stained. Yeah. This would totally like catch the stain and like it would be so hard to get out. It feels like a blanket though. Yeah, it's super soft. That one, <laughs> funky. What about that one in your hand right now? Uh, Not that one, like these ones. Do you think these are too light? Yeah, It'll get dirty. Fun. I like the color. Here's another option. This one's soft. Let's compare them. A little bit lighter. This one's more light than that one. Yeah. That one kind of looks, this kind of like just looks dirty, I feel like. Thank you, y'all. This is the couch. <laughs> it's a big L couch. We're not gonna get this part because it's too big. So we're just gonna get from here on. Super comfy, super cozy. <sighs> and it's great, and I'm so excited. And it's so comfy. And we're getting on a discount because it's Labor Day weekend. Yeah, Labor Day weekend, so we get a sale. Okay. They honestly look so alike. <laughs> they look so similar. This one, it's like be more of the lines. You know what I mean? Yeah. And this one's like. They look super similar though, right now. It would look nice. Okay, so I feel like you can't really see the real color, but this is the couch color, and this is the pillows that we're getting with it. Go show them the couch with it. So it comes with two of these pillows, and then two of these pillows. Go show them the couch with it. Okay. So this is actually the color that we picked out, but on a different couch. So this is kind of what it would look like. A nice light color, just like that and on that L couch right here. So we have this color and this couch. <laughs> Yay, it's so comfy. 
I'm so excited. Your first purchase for the new house. A big purchase. A big purchase. Get out the way. <laughs> Yay.